Gather around, sit down, and guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm here for some more Finding Paradise, the To The Moon sequel. In this episode, it looks like we're going to go back into his, uh, quote-unquote future, his old age part of his life, and, uh, see what's going on. See if we can find some more things that he, he regrets in his life. Oh, this is a small space. And obviously this here generates, uh, stuff, so we gotta... I don't really know how this is gonna work. Because now we've got no more space, right? Do we have to... we have to clear something out. Right. And now we can, like... Do that. Uh... Okay, and we're good. 100%? 100%. Beautiful. So the flowers were our memento, and w last episode we had learned that, um, Faye and Sophia have the same tune going on. So are they the same person, or are they different? What's so special about Faye versus Sophia? But guys, let's go through the memento. And I just want to give, whilst we're going through this memento, I want to give a quick shout out to our Discorder of the week. This week it is Khan Cute. He's a new Discorder, very new Discorder, and he is also um, very active in my YouTube comments. So all around, I just wanted to give him a big shout out because, you know, he's super, super special to this, to, to this community because of how much support he gives. And I love the support he gives. Guys... If you guys want more of a chance of being Discord of the Week, be active on my YouTube and my Discord. But guys, thank you so much, either way. Huh, have you ever seen wild hibiscus around this part of the world? Don't know, I'm not the one to be plantologist. It's called botanist. Oh, hey, look over there. What's up? Oh, this is a short one. We're at a playground, it's when it, when is son was a kid. What's going on? Careful up there, Ash. Those look a bit loose. It's all good, Dad. I got this. You should come up here and play too. Listen, at least come down and let me fix it first. Never! Uh. Huh. What's going on? <gasps> Wait a minute. Who's this? Who is this? This lady. What's so special about her? What? Oh no. Are you okay, son? Who was that? Ash? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm invincible! Huh. And the lady's gone. Who was she? Was that... Faye? Does he not... Love Sophia? Was that? Don't know, let's try not to jump to conclusions. What the hell? I wanna know! Okay, the tires of the memento. Yo! What's wrong with him? The joy of being a parent, probably. Can we stop this kid from running around? No. God damn it. Okay, well, we only needed two two things. That was weird. That was a weird memory. Some memory lanes route the way we remember. Huh. That was cool. So that just shot it up, rather than it going straight across, it went up as well. That's quite cool. That was such a short memory. That was really weird. Oh! We're not back as a kid! Oh no, we are. He's... I mean, he doesn't look super young. But I guess he's kind of like a... A semi-teenager now. Badger? Ah, get wrecked! Get wrecked, son! <sighs> That's him sighing, by the way. Oh! Is that Faye? 
Been waiting for me, huh? Oh, what took you so long? Sheesh, I made it, didn't I? I got a life, you know. Whoa. Whoa, where'd you learn to do that? It's called talent. <laughs> Come on, when you gonna show me your school? Yeah, the classroom should be clear by now. Are you gonna stay for our band practice as well? Yeah, yeah, lead the way. High school crush. Aw, don't they remind you of us when we were young? Not one bit. Huh. Interesting. So, this is obviously his school. I'm assuming he's sort of like maybe 30. Wait a minute. Huh, the school looks familiar. Exactly. Small world. But then again, I guess many of the geezers here grew up in the same area. This is the exact same school as the last game. This is where we have our art class. Neat. Are any of these drawings yours? Uh, no. Uh, mine got thrown out. Uh, these are the good ones. They're not very good. Well, let's be honest. I just don't know how they do it. I wish I could draw half as good. Oh, you draw plenty good, buddy. To the gym? To the gym! Oh, no, I need three. Okay. What are you guys blocking me for? Oh, okay, we've got a couple more classes. And I sit right over there. Although, I'm probably gonna move soon. How come? Well, I sat with this odd girl because we're both really quiet, but recent? Well, she's been hanging out with someone. A lot. River? Was he sitting with River? So? So they'll want to sit together, of course. They're bumping you off. Let me beat them up for you. Oh, it's nothing like that. <laughs> they just look happy together, so I should get them to sit at the same table, right? Is that River? Are they talking about River? Did you sit with the river? Colin! Oh my god. It's so cute. I'm getting teary just thinking about the fact that they they were the same. Is the cafeteria locked? Nah, I just don't like going in there. There are plenty of other nicer and quieter places to eat at. So he doesn't eat in the cafeteria? I wonder whether he even knew. Was it John in the last game? Johnny? Yeah. The one class everybody slacks off and and you actually work? Eh, I like these classes. If you really try hard, you can create entire worlds in them. How cool is that? Well, that does sound like your thing. And then gym class. Wait, but the gym is this way. Do they do band practice in the gym? That's probably got terrible acoustics. Or, really, or is it really good acoustics? I don't know. This is the gym. Okay, so they're just hanging out. No, they are doing... Uh, oh, no, I guess it makes sense. No, it would have... I don't know music. I'm not a musician. He stopped playing! He's ruining it for everyone. Oh, she's bored. Aww. Oh, he finds it funny that she just fell asleep. That's kind of rude. I can almost hear her snores through the strings. I can almost see her snores. Right, and now we can get up on the clock again. Another clock is a memento. What the hell is going on? What is going on? I don't understand. Prepare. So, if I do that, that'll do that. If I do that. And then we want to go there. And there! Ding, ding, ding! So good. Professional. Professional quality memento activating. The one bit of the game that's like kind of game related I'm great at. You know, if Faye was so important that he recalls so much about her even now... What happened to her? We haven't seen any traces later on. I have a few guesses. Do you now? Dang, nabbit. Is Faye Sophia? 
That is my question. Or does she pass away? Oh. At the flight bureau? Something important's going on. An airplane pilot hat. At a hospital? Why, what's going on? Who are these people? Who are you? Wrong room, sorry. Huh. Okay, I think you went this way. Yep. Sorry, fear the storm grounded my plane back all day and I just... You made it. Oh, he's gonna regret missing the day his baby was born. He regrets being late for Asher. Is that? Uh. Honey, you're vibrating the baby. Uh. Uh, I'm just gonna be right back. He's freaking out. I'm sure he regrets not being there. But he's regained composure. He had a bit of a freak out. What are you doing? Just grabbed a piece of paper. Um, he had a mini freak out. Understandable. You're happy though, right? Of course I am. It's just that... I don't know, I was in... such a rush to get back and suddenly seeing him here. I guess I just needed a moment for it to sink in. Hey, it's okay. I feel it too, you know? But, well, maybe it's as they say. Maybe we're never meant to feel ready. How could I when I feel no different from the kid I was yesterday? But you are. You are different, even from the man you were when I first met you. I don't know what changed, but... You're no longer aloof, you know? When you're here, you're actually... Here. Heh. <laughs> I couldn't even make it here when he was born. Well, hey. We didn't know he was so eager to meet us early. What matters is you're here now, and we're gonna be okay. Asher, what's going on, buddy? Oh, he's making the paper airplane? <laughs> is the paper airplanes what made him want to be a pilot? Oh, and he's not vibrating the baby this time. Yeah. We're gonna be okay. Oh. Regret. Absence. So he regrets not being around as much. What is this? Oh, the paper airplane is the memento. And I guess they had it flashing because it's like white on white. It's quite hard to see. That's quite helpful. Let's prepare this memento. Uh, fuck, what? Right, not too hard. No, nothing difficult. That wasn't hard at all. We did good. The paper airplane is another memento, and we're obviously going to go back to when he was a kid. Yeah, we're going to be okay. Don't know why I tried to use him to teleport into the... How could I? When I feel no different from the kid I was yesterday. But you are different. 
Even from the man you were when I first met you. What the? Why did that replay? Got another airplane, he's out on the balcony and he's got his musical instrument. And we're on the other side of the roof. Awesome. Uh, wow, far out. Where is he? Did we get drifted from the spawn point? Don't worry, I got this. Is he gonna like break the wall? What are you doing? What have you got? He's on the other side, right? We could just... Shh. Oh. Look, Neil, all we want to do is get over that wall. I don't know what you're planning, but let's try to keep it simple. Don't worry, it doesn't get any simpler than this. Uh, grappling hook. Is that... Hook shot! Ah, uh, Legend of Zelda. Come on, give me a break. I've always wanted to try this. Alright, I guess it's straightforward enough. Yeah! <laughs> okay. So I gotta left click or press space. Near full power. I can feel it, Ava! What? This hook shot is the hook shot that will pierce the heavens! Uh. What the fuck? Dude, untrick Neptune and put it back in orbit right now. Relax, it was copy paste, not cut paste. Not to mention in part procedurally generated. Now let me just turn on its localized gravity. Wait, what? Are we gonna get forced onto the <laughs> Neptune and then dropped onto the. <laughs> what is wrong with you? What? You said it was alright to use my hookshot. Now let's turn the gravity off and... <laughs> Bye Neptune, thanks for the lift. Neptune's helping me even in the best of times. At least it wasn't Uranus. What was that? Nothing. Uh, let's get going. Oh my gosh, it was ridiculous. I guess we're going to have to jump again. Huh. Talk about staying up past bedtime. Don't even bother. It's not gonna fly over, you know? <laughs> We're too far apart. So, are you ever gonna finish telling me that story? Huh? The one with the injured bird you found when you were a kid. There's not much to it. You know how it goes. The bird had a broken wing and I took care of it for a while. The vet took it in afterwards, but wait. Is this the kid that's from Bird Story or something? But what? Uh, but I tried to steal the bird back. You thought you'd take better care of it? Of course not. I knew I shouldn't have. Then why? Because it was my only friend, I guess. I just didn't want to let it go. Wait, are they combining all the games? Because I'm pretty sure it's like Bird's Story. So this is the same kid as the game A Bird's Story. That's so cool. It all links together. This is all one big universe. That's awesome. He just didn't want to let it go. Wow, what a load of sappy saccharine. I might give you a handkerchief for a dog or even a cat, but a bird? I knew I shouldn't have said anything. Just... Everyone I told that story to either thought that or I got bored to sleep. Yeah, can't help you there. But everyone goes into things with their own context, you know? Maybe it's only fair that they didn't care for it much. Maybe the bird was something different to you than it was to them. Or maybe you just sucked at telling that story. I just wanted them to relate. Yeah, but how did that work out for you? 
Not every story is meant to be told, you know. Some of them are meant to be kept. So, how did it end? I... I think the bird flew off. I think I lost it, but it came back to say goodbye one day. You think? I don't know. I kept on mixing up reality with daydream back then. I guess I was living in my head a little too much. Oh, this is so cool! Please make it. Oh, it made it. Huh. You're getting better at this. I used to daydream about taking off on a big paper plane, you know? We'd fly all over the world, seeing all kinds of sights. <laughs> and I could just fly across from balcony to balcony. Well, that's dumb. You can't fly on paper planes, silly. No, duh. I mean, if you really want to fly so bad, why don't you go and become a pilot? Heh. <laughs> it's not a- wait, you're serious? Yeah, why not? What do you mean, why not? Uh, one doesn't simply just go and become a pilot. Why doesn't one? Because... how? Well, planes take off from airports, right? It doesn't hurt to find one and ask. Uh, that's... If only it could be that simple. If you just let it be, maybe it could. Oh, the parents are... I should go, Colin. I know. Hey. I'm gonna look for that airport tomorrow. Oh, what a good boy. Colin, you're such a good boy. Received note, flying. Oh, what a good story. Oh my god, that was... That was such a beautiful episode. Not only did it link to the moon and the fact that he went to the same school and it sounds like he sat next to River, but also he's the kid from a bird story. And if you guys don't know what a bird story is, it's like a wee mini, mini game. It's a mini episode sort of thing. And I guess I thought it was just like a completely different story altogether. But it's about Colin, and it's about the story he just told. He found a bird, and it became his best friend, but the bird was sick, so he took it to a vet, but the vet wouldn't let him have it back, and so he stole the bird again, and the bird flew away. But one day the bird did come back and, you know, said goodbye. And that was such a, I mean, some people didn't like it, but I thought it was such a cute little story. Oh my god, everything just connected. And that really was so satisfying. Guys, I'm really satisfied with that episode. If you guys are, let me know down in the comments below. Did you like how it just linked everything together? It just linked to the moon with this game. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you did enjoy the episode. And I'll see you in the next episode, whatever I make. Stay safe, fam. See ya!